Now, just one piece of advice, inshallah, for both the bride and the groom. Every man, no matter how successful and accomplished that man may be, tend to carry with them from their childhood certain bad habits. I'm not going to reveal the groom's age, but in all of these years that he spent at home, these bad habits have existed. So the bride, uh, my sister, the chances of you getting rid of them are slim to none. So identify which bad habits these are and uh, cut him some slack in this regard inshallah and uh, that should yield very positive results. The groom, you know, mashallah, he's traveled here all the way from the UK. Right? So that's an awfully long way to travel for the purpose of giving up your freedom of thought and freedom of opinion. So the, the one piece of advice that I always give the groom is when you walk into the masjid on the day of your nikah, that is the absolute last time you get to choose how you dress and how you act and what you do in the morning and what you have for breakfast and uh, everything in between, right? So, you know, uh, Congratulations, welcome to the club. Munawwar Hussain, do you accept Sister Sanya Maham Makhdumi to be your wife in accordance with the laws of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala and the sunnah of his Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa sallam? Yes. So all of them it's fine, but you need to say it a bit louder than that. Yes.